With fuel prices reaching record highs, drivers might be looking for more ways to help save fuel and prevent their wallets from hurting so much and one way drivers are doing so is by using the hypermile technique. Hypermiling is a term that refers to when a driver changes or alters their driving habits to maximize fuel efficiency, saving a pretty penny in the process, reports the Daily Express. One such successful hypermiler is Kevin Bricker, 44, a Guinness World Record holder. Kevin, who works for National Parks in Brecon but lives in Swansea, claims you could up to £600 over a year by using the technique. He said he began hypermiling in an attempt to relieve his boredom on the regular 70-mile trip he had to take, the Manchester Evening News reports. Martin Lewis shares more than 60 ways to legitimately boost your household income. It was almost a way to gamify it, he said, to get the fuel I was using to go further. I was learning the techniques to get the most out of that gallon. In an interview with The Guardian, Kevin said, the bonus was I was saving money. Over a month, I could save up to £50 without really increasing my journey time. Most cars have a range meter now, telling you how many miles you have left. You do find you try to go further than the car thinks it can go on the fuel you've got. Kevin said driving as slowly as is reasonable, and in the highest possible gear without laboring your engine, is the cheapest way to drive. He urges people to consider hypermiling in order to save hundreds of pounds per year. One of the most important factors when it comes to hypermiling is avoiding harsh acceleration or braking. In most fueled cars, energy is wasted whenever a driver slams the brakes, while most hybrid and electric cars have regenerative braking where around 70% of the energy used goes back into the battery. Mr. Brooker added, read the road ahead for traffic lights and roundabouts, so you always keep moving. If there's a green light a fair distance off, there's a high probability it will be red by the time you get to it. It's all about pacing, so you get there when it's green. With roundabouts, feed into them rather than stop. Of course, drivers should slow down wherever reasonable and in the highest possible gear without putting too much strain on the engine. Motorists should also avoid holding the gear in high revs while keeping with the flow of traffic. On average, drivers are paying 163.52p for a litre of petrol, while super unleaded comes in at 176.14p per litre. Meanwhile, diesel drivers are still suffering from higher prices, with a litre costing 177.47p, resulting in most motorists paying almost £100 for a full tank of fuel. Kevin Brooker also advises drivers to look at potentially switching their cars, he personally drives a Hyundai Ioniq electric car. Brooker has worked out the electricity for his round trip to work now costs 97p, despite soaring electricity prices. One of his world records comes in an electric car, as he was able to drive from John O'Groats to Land's End with just one stop to recharge.